after the the crash, the great financial crisis uh, in the UK, along came the idea of the Challenger Bank. The government wanted more competition in banking, and so you know began to issue new licenses. I mean, there's more than 30. In fact, it might be heading towards 40 by now. So we've had lots of new banks. But they haven't really challenged anything. In fact, the proportion of deposits held by the big four has actually gone up. I think it's something like two thirds of all deposits at the moment. So in order to improve things, to make you know, more innovation, to reduce prices, to, to get better services, we don't need more challenger banks. We need more competition to banks. We don't need necessarily more banks. We need payment accounts. We need to use open banking to have specialists that can bring together the different services in the right way. We need perhaps different bundles of things. Not, not, just, the, not just the money, but the data that goes around it. it like, we don't need challengers, we need competitors. 